Alright, welcome to this tutorial from EasyCut. Alright, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to make a nice, uh, simple PHP and MySQL search engine. And as you can see, I made mine look like Google. Uh, I'm going to put all the download in the description, so you can download the links and the um, every all the files, the PHP files. And in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to make the database. And that's all you need to worry about, so this is what I'm going to search. search. And it's come up with 39 results for search. And as you can see, the links on the side. It's got the next and the previous button. Next and previous. And it's got shows all the pages with how many results. And it should display 10 results on a page. Alright. Also, one other thing that I have put in this search engine that I made. You, you can add your URL. I haven't put any... Um, validation on it you might want to or you might want to also make this members only so members can sign up and register their uh, link and the URL and put it in so let's make one called my who or whatever you want to call it description lol URL uh, www.mahu.com keywords mahu you can put as many keywords as you want but I'm putting one for this tutorial Alright, thank you. The information has been entered into our database. Um, we can go back. And then we want to search Mahu. And it comes up. There we go. Mahu. Mahu.com. Searched or indexed into our database. Alright, so to make this database, what you want to do is you want to make a database called search. You want to open up PHP My Admin. And you want to make a database called search. I already have one, so I'm going to call it search1. You're going to call it search then create it All right. in here you want to create a table called search engine and you want to give it five fields oops five fields so you want to click go and there we go it loads up so you want to call this one ID you want to call this one um, in here, you're going to call it title, uh, you want to call that one description, underneath title, you want to call the other one URL, and you want to call this last one keywords. Alright, you want to leave ID as an integer, you want to make it Order increment and you want to make it primary key. So let's scroll across to index and we'll make it primary and AI tick for order increment. And uh, title, we want to make it varchar, then 100 long. Title varchar value is 100. We want to make uh, description, we want to make it text, we want to make URL text and keywords we want varchar and 200 long varchar and 200 so then we can go down to the bottom and click save all right and that created all the tables that we need all right so now that's all you need for that now open up the files what that i have put up in the uh, description for download and in here you want to open up the index file you want to edit it all right you want to go to um all right wrong one you don't want to open up the index i forgot you have to open up list edit notepad or dreamweaver you're going to put in your host name mine's localhost you want to put in your username mine's root you want to put your password i have no password Database, we just made it so it's search, and the database table is search engine. And then leave everything else as it is. You want to save that and close it out. You want to open up the search.php file. And in here, you want to scroll down a bit until you can see connect to database. In here, you want to type in um, your database um, host, mine's localhost, username, uh, root, and... I have no password, your password would be there. And select DB 
and search and make sure you leave the other one as search engine the table um and search yeah that's it now you want to save that and close it out and then when you load it up you can open it up go to the link go there insert anything you can change all the images that are in the files you can change the looks of the of the site and add it to your web page add it anywhere you want if you need uh, and yep that's basically it if you need more help or if you want a tutorial on how to edit it and change the looks or anything else like that add some validation make it members can only add their um, link and all you have to do is give me a private message give me an email give me something asking what you want me to do and i'll make a tutorial as soon as possible all uh, right thank you for watching this video from easy touch i'll watch more later